Picture this, it's 2 a.m. And Sarah, a dedicated nurse and mother of two, sits at her kitchen table, staring at a letter. The hospital where she's worked for 15 years is closing, and she's just lost her job. Her hands tremble as she wonders, God, where are you in this? What's going to happen to us? Have you ever been there? Facing an uncertain future, feeling like the ground beneath your feet has suddenly disappeared? Today, we're tackling a truth that can transform your perspective, trusting an unknown future to a known God. If you're feeling lost, scared, or unsure about what's ahead, this message is for you. Stick with me for the next 15 minutes, and I promise, you'll discover a source of hope and peace that can weather any storm. Hit that like button and subscribe, because we're about to unlock the secret to finding stability in life's most unstable moments. The Unchanging Nature of God Let's dive right into our key verse, Job 23 verses 13 to 14, but he is unchangeable, and who can turn him back? What he desires, that he does. For he will complete what he appoints for me, and many such things are in his mind. Now, I want you to pause and let that sink in. In a world where everything seems to be constantly changing, where the only certainty seems to be uncertainty, we serve an unchangeable God. A God who isn't swayed by circumstances, who doesn't waver in his love for us, who remains constant even when everything around us is in flux. But here's the kicker, this unchanging nature of God isn't just a nice theological concept. It's a lifeline we can cling to when the storms of life threaten to overwhelm us. So how do we anchor ourselves to this unchanging God? Let's break it down. Understanding God's plan. The first step in trusting an unknown future to a known God is understanding that God has a plan. Not just a vague, general plan, but a specific, detailed plan for your life. I remember counseling a young man, let's call him David. He had just graduated college, full of dreams and ambitions. But six months later, he was still unemployed, living in his parents' basement, feeling like a failure. It wasn't until David began to trust in God's plan that things started to change. You see, God's plan isn't always clear to us in the moment. It's like a tapestry, from the back, it looks like a mess of tangled threads. But from God's perspective, it's a beautiful masterpiece in the making. Our job isn't to understand every detail of the plan, but to trust the planner. Hope in uncertainty. Now, let's get practical. How do we maintain hope when everything around us seems uncertain? It's not about putting on a fake smile or pretending everything's okay. It's about anchoring ourselves to something, or rather, someone who's bigger than our circumstances think of it like this when you're on a boat in stormy seas you don't anchor to another boat you anchor to something immovable like a large rock in the same way when life gets stormy we don't anchor ourselves to changeable things like our job our relationships or our bank account we anchor ourselves to the unchanging God. So, how do we do this practically? Number one, daily meditation on God's promises. Let his word be your anchor. 
Number two, prayer. Not just talking at God, but listening and trusting his guidance. Number three, community. Surround yourself with fellow believers who can remind you of God's faithfulness. When Sarah, our nurse from earlier, started implementing these practices, her perspective began to shift. The circumstances didn't change overnight, but her ability to face them with hope did. She anchored herself to God's unchanging nature. Trusting God's character? Now, let's talk about what it means to trust God's character. You see, trust isn't just about believing God can do something, it's about believing He will do what's best for us. When you're facing financial uncertainty, trust that God is your provider. When you're dealing with health issues, Trust that God is your healer. When you're struggling with loneliness, trust that God is your comforter. I've seen God's character shine through in the darkest of times. I've witnessed him provide jobs when all doors seemed closed, bring healing when doctors had given up hope, and restore relationships that seemed beyond repair. Remember, Proverbs 3 verses 5 to 6 tells us, Trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding, in all your ways submit to him, and he will make your path straight. This isn't just a nice saying, it's a promise we can stake our lives on. Embracing the journey so, what does it look like to truly trust an unknown future to a known God? It's about embracing the journey, even when we can't see the destination. When you're trusting God, uncertainty becomes an adventure rather than a threat. Waiting times become growing times. Obstacles become opportunities for God to show his power. You start to see life through God's eyes, and let me tell you, it's a game changer. You realize that with God, no experience is wasted, no pain is purposeless, and no detour is a dead end. As we wrap up, I want to pray over you that you would find the courage to trust God with your unknown future, starting today. Heavenly Father, we come before you today, grateful for your unchanging nature in our ever-changing world. Lord, for every person watching this who feels uncertain, afraid, or lost about their future, I pray that your peace would flood their hearts right now. God, we admit that we often try to control our futures, to map out every detail. But Lord, we recognize that you are the ultimate planner, the master designer of our lives. Help us to trust you even when we can't trace your hand. Father, for those facing seemingly impossible situations, I pray that you would remind them of your faithfulness in the past. Give them a supernatural boost of faith to believe in your good plans for their future. Lord, teach us to anchor ourselves to you, our unchanging rock. Help us prioritize time in your word, in prayer, and in community with other believers. Let these practices become our lifeline in times of uncertainty. God, we thank you that you are not just able to guide our futures, but that you are willing and eager to do so. Open our eyes to see your guidance all around us. Transform our fear of the unknown into excited anticipation of what you will do. Finally, Lord, I pray that each person watching would experience a tangible manifestation of your peace and guidance in their lives this week. 
whether it's in their career, relationships, personal growth, or spiritual journey, let them see your hand at work in unmistakable ways. We love you, Lord, and we thank you for being our unchanging God in an ever-changing world. In Jesus' mighty name, Amen. Friends, remember, your future may be unknown to you, but it's not unknown to God. You don't have to face uncertainty alone. Trust in his unchanging nature, hope in his faithful character, and watch your life transform. If this message has encouraged you, please share it with someone who needs hope today. Don't forget to subscribe for more biblical insights and practical faith tips. Until next time, keep trusting our known God with your unknown future.